Hey guys, welcome back to Populous The Beginning and we are here on mission number 19, Unlikely Allies. So, we just got past Headhunter, we're now here, and uh, I don't know if we're actually going to be allied with anyone here, but let's see what what's in store for us on this little planet. Alright, the Dakini have grown too powerful on this world. I am suspicious of allying my tribe with the Chumara, but I must protect their settlement and prevent the Dakini from destroying us all. So I gotta protect the Chumara? Okay, looks like uh, the Chumara is right there. Let's get things going. Um, houses, we need houses. Let's uh, try be space efficient with this. And we can... How many trees do we have? Oh, we do have quite a few trees. So we don't have to worry too much. Let's get these going. Focus on converting some... Graves? Uh, uh, yes. And uh, how much space do we have? We got some nice space down here. Oh, we got quite a bit of nice space. Alright. Let's uh, convert these guys. And we'll immediately send them over to worship at the Stonehead. It looks like there's a lot of... Uh, wildlings. And there's the... Oh, the Dakini. They're gonna come from here. Okay. Let's convert this group. We can use them to start setting up a settlement on this side. So, build a watchtower right here, please. And continue converting. Alright. So the Chumara are over here, but it said we have to protect them from the Dakini. Okay, the Chumara are actually on the same island. So we could protect them by either going to the Chumara or attacking the Dakini. And it seems like attacking the Dakini... There is a stone head there. That might be something that's... We might be able to reach with a, a watchtower if we build that there. Okay, you build that. Let's split up the workforce. Come on. You go build that one. Alright, nice. Now, this is done. So, let's go ahead and build another house over here. Start charging up our spells. We'll need a land bridge. You go join there. And let's... Yeah, get some people on the Stonehead. Alright, no more wildlings. So, it did say we have to protect the Chumara, right? Allying my tribe with the Chumara, but I must protect their settlement and prevent the Dakini from destroying us all. So, does that mean they actually won't attack us? No, we can we can still attack them, which is a bit strange. Uh, let's build another guard tower down here, so we can actually uh, start expanding down to that area. And this house is done. Gotta start training up some military though. I suppose... Uh, we'll just put down a couple houses here for now. And we'll grab two more of you guys. You go worship at the stone head. My shaman. Gonna come over this side. Get in that watchtower. See if we can sneak over and get that uh, stone head. Alright, so. We're basically just setting up our base now. Hopefully nothing bad happens. Oh, we do have that priest. We gotta get some defenses up. I gotta leave my shaman here to stop any priests from coming and messing up everything. Alright, so we'll keep our base going and uh, yeah, hopefully things go along quite nicely. Uh-oh, look at that. The Dakini are attacking the Chumara. Can they hold their own? I really don't know. But I can't do anything about that. Um, huh. Alright. Let's just protect our own people for now. Um, can we get that guy? I don't know if my... Oh, we got something. What's that? This is the teleport spell. Use teleport to move instantly to any location in the world. Oh, okay. So that's how we're going to be protecting our people. And uh, the Chumara... I don't know if we can actually protect them. That's, uh, that's a bit extreme. 
Well, we'll see if they survive. If not, um, what's this? Your allies' defenses have been breached. They are under attack. Well, maybe I had to rush, uh, rush some military. Maybe that's what I was supposed to do? Because I don't know if, um, they're gonna survive this. Well, we'll see what happens. Alright, so I'm boosting up my defenses here by uh, building up these walls so that they uh, can't land. Um, so that's pretty good because they were, they kept sending boats around and attacking me, so I'm just sort of uh, making sure that boats can't land from this side. Meanwhile, I'm training up an army and the Chumara are not quite dead yet, um, but they did take a beating. Uh, meanwhile, with the teleport spell, I could actually teleport over here and start worshipping at this stone head. So that is something that I might want to start doing. Um, but let's train up a few more soldiers before I start teleporting anywhere. And also, uh, there's a few of these gaps I'd like to seal off if possible to make sure the boats don't uh, come down that way. Um, but we'll see how that goes. Alright, let's try a bit of a... Uh, um, harassment. We might not be able to save the Chumara because they're taking quite a beating. But if I teleport over here, this stone head might be something. So let's try teleport here, see what happens. Is it just me? Only I get to teleport? Well, that's not so good. Um, but we can at least uh, do a few things. Stop their fire, war fire warrior production. And uh, let's see, where's the entrance to the fire warrior hut? They're going to want to start repairing that, so we, if we put a swamp down... Let's, uh... Ooh, we're being attacked here. Yeah? Ooh, let's be careful of that. Stop their warrior production. Alright, that should at least slow down... ...some of their stuff, but I really need more spells than this. <laughs> Uh-oh, I'm under attack. Let's save ourselves. And let's uh, teleport back home. I thought I was gonna bring all my people over. Wait, what? All my soldiers died because they couldn't get to me. Oh, wow, okay. So if, uh, if um, my soldiers are set to guard and they can't reach me, they actually just die because they can't get there. <laughs> okay, well, um, you learn something new every day. Oh, we're, we're almost under, under, under attack here by the Dakini. Look at that. Um, but uh, it seems like they, they miscast their spells a little bit. Oh, she's coming for us. Let's uh, just be careful here. Let's see if we can actually lightning all of these guys. Come on, get in range in time. Yes. Die. Oh, those guys are protected. Okay, well, I was gonna start um, attacking... Oh, no, 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 that's not good. Did we kill those preachers? No, we didn't kill all the preachers. Damn it. We're gonna have to split up our troops here a bit. Okay. They're attacking our stuff here. It's a bit of a setback, but I think we'll we'll be okay. That that shield uh, spell is very powerful, but um, we'll be retaliating soon enough. Come on, let's kill these guys, and we'll get this stuff fixed up pretty soon. Okay, uh, just a few things to deal with. Oh, they're still streaming in. This isn't so good. Come on, kill this guy. Yes, okay, thank you. Now, let's uh, let's start retaliating, I think. Um, our braves are already fixing things up. Now, let's go disable some of the Dakini stuff. Um, but actually, let's, uh, let's go this way. Because, uh... I'm going to attack from the back, and let's uh, train a couple guys on the back of this. Some preachers might be able to keep us alive. 
They're already repairing the warrior hut. Did we lose anything? We lost the house. Um, let's send this guy to repair that one at least. And up here, let's charge up one of our land bridge spells. And our land bridge over here, get that stone head and attack him from the back. Alright, here we go. Land bridge across to here. Alright. So, where, where's my shaman? There we go. So now we have a land bridge to the back of their base. Let's grab one, two, three, four, five, six braves. Go pray at that thing. And let's uh, do some damage. We don't need to charge that up. Swamps are always useful. I don't think I have time to charge up much else, but let's uh, take care of that. Where are they coming from? Are they rushing through here? Let's do that. Ooh, more of them coming. Cast another swamp there. Alright, this should severely damage the guys coming to attack us. More of them are coming. There we go. This at least severely reduces the number of soldiers they have. There we go. That should give us enough opportunity to go mess them up. Oh, their shaman is there. We gotta be careful. They have so much stuff. Come on, give me some spells. Almost, almost. Give me a swamp spell. Pass the swamp right there. Yes! Let's stop their production of warriors. All right, now we can do some damage. Let's go spread these guys around. All right, they have a few more units over there, but nothing too major to be concerned about. Let's send uh, a preacher around this side. All right, this is good, this is good. It looks like they're trying to attack the Chumara again, but uh, that's fine. <laughs> oh, Shaman's back. Let's try target this properly. Damn, I missed. Where's she going? Where is that temple, by the way? It's there. Okay, let's just stop their preacher production. All right, you guys, group up. Okay. So this attack's going quite well, actually. They're attacking the Chumara, which is a bad idea. I don't know if the Chumara will survive, but uh, the Dakini won't have anything left after this. Let's uh, grab a couple soldiers. Go attack here. Go attack here. Go attack here. Uh, we're not selecting the right soldiers. There we go. Soldiers can do quite a bit of damage. Our preacher's over there. The Dakini Shaman is in that tower. Hey, we got a volcano spell. That's gonna be perfect. Let's stop their Shaman first. And a volcano right here. Haratanka, and let's back out. And uh, there's not gonna be much left after that. <laughs> oh, pull a house right in the middle. Uh, my preacher there is gonna die. Unless I can get him out in time? Ooh, I got him out in time. Very nice. Oh, fantastic. Was it just uh, the one? Yeah. You guys on the back of this go become. Uh, warriors. Just in case we do need more people uh, after all of this. But I don't think we do. I think we're good to go. Alright, we gotta start stopping all these houses. You attack that, you attack that. Where am I? 
There? Okay. Let's, uh, we gotta... How do I kill all of these guys in the boats? Does that kill them? I don't think it does. Oh well, let's, uh, there's just a few more houses here. That shaman might come back, so let's, uh, do that. Now, any more fresh houses? Doesn't look like it. It's just scattered braves here and there. What is this? Get out! You guys group up around me. You guys just go attack that. And, uh, we just have to scout for the remaining... Enemy Braves, where are they? We've taken that out, we've taken that out. I'm looking at the map, trying to find any villagers. Is it just that one guy there? All right, I think it's just that one guy. From this this first attack where they uh, dropped off. What is that? There's a stone head over here, wow. With a swamp. Um, huh. Well, that might be like an angel of death or something, but this last brave here, time to die. Unfortunate for you. There we go. <laughs> ah, we managed it. And yes, it was an angel of death spell. Look at that. And, uh, huh. That volcano really did speed things up. And the Chumara. Are they our allies? Well, I guess so. They managed to hold their own, which was good. Um, but, uh... Yeah, building a wall around my base to stop those boats from coming in really did help. Look at this, we've got this massive wall going all the way around. It's just this little uh, entrance that the Dakini made, but... Uh, well, that attack was dealt with. Anyway, that's the end of this. Let's press spacebar to continue. That was mission number 19, Unlikely Allies. Took us just about 25 minutes there. And, uh, yeah, let's go back to the solar system. And that is the last of the four choices here. And we're now looking at mission number 20, Archipelago, and mission 21, Fractured Earth. But uh, we're going to go to this one next. Anyway, that's the end of this mission. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.